Hi guys, today I will show you how to install commotion firmware on Ubuntu built M2. The commotion firmware can be downloaded from commotion wireless.net. It is an open source firmware used for building community based Wi-Fi mesh network you can download the firmware from the sites For fresh installation, you have to download factory install file. And if you have already installed the promotion firmware and want to upgrade, then the upgrade file is there to upgrade the promotion firmware. Here it is downloaded. Now connect to your access point and login into it I have already logged into my bulletin to go to system and upload the firmware wait for minutes the uploading Now click update to write the firmware on the router and make sure that your router is connected via wire and please do not turn off your router as the installation will fail and make up the firmware as well it will take a few minutes so hang on I have already downloaded and installed one of the firmware on my router this is the second router I am going to install the commercial firmware after installation in the next tutorial I will show you the configuration so stay tuned for the next video as well after the firmware installation you will need to change the certified address of the connected network and the key router is connected to obtain automatically because from the static IP you will not be able to access the router or the access point as the IP screen will be changed after installation of the firmware so just wait a second it's about to complete you can subscribe my youtube channel home tech where i have i have already uploaded some of the tutorial regarding micro tech router setting and some api web for the micro tech to configure and manage from there here it is, it is completed now go to the internet setting and change the IP address from static to obtain it automatically so that we can log into the interface for our configuration
there I have selected the IP address to turn automatically wait for a minute I will check to confirm the IP has been turned here it is it is turned at 214.0.145 now you can access the web interface by entering http colon slash slash this node but sometimes it does not work so you have to enter the ip address Just check the IP address and now enter it in the address bar to open the configuration. So, thanks for watching.